What was your recruitment process like going to Duke? Yeah, so like my first two years of high school, everyone thought I was just going to Washington, really. You know, both my parents went there. My mom was a, a basketball player, so I really wasn't getting recruited uh, really anywhere outside of the West Coast. And then going into my junior year, that's when college coaches could start reaching out. Mike Miller actually was the first coach when he was at Memphis. They were the first school out, outside of the Pac-12 to offer me a scholarship. Like two months after that, like June is when I started hearing from everybody. Mm -hmm. um, that's, and that's when I started really playing well in the camps and all the live periods. Mm -hmm. it was hooping. What's the best advice Coach K gave you? Yeah, nah, I, the one I say all the time is, especially me, you told me like exit meetings like before I left, was that you gotta be sharp everywhere you go. You gotta have a strong face, strong body language everywhere you go. Especially, and then on the court, that translates on and off the court. You know, on the court, you don't want to show weakness. You don't want to, you know, give your opponent any edge. So you want to keep a straight, you know, straight face and just look strong all the time. And then off the court, you know, when you walk in a room or when you in public, you know, you always want to look presentable. You always want to be on point, you know, because when when you walk in the room, everybody's gonna look at you. Mm -hmm. You know, so that was that's the best advice. Knowing it was Coach K last year. How much pressure was on y'all to bring a championship home? It was definitely a lot of pressure, you know, but I think we handled it well, mm -hmm. you know, as well as we could. Um, and our goal, we, we had pressure kind of our own expectations as well, you know. Coach would tell us all the time, like, don't do this for, for me, you know, do it for you guys, do it for y'all. So that was just our mentality. That's bullshit, though. This yeah. your last year, Coach. <laughs> yeah, that's why I don't want to hear that. This hey, your last nah, year. I mean, we, nah, we definitely, like, yeah. that was part of our thing. Like, we wanted to do it for, for Coach as well. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, so that was our mindset, but... You know, he definitely always told us to keep it about us, um, even though sometimes you just couldn't run from it. Right, right. <laughs> That's Coach K, you know, he's the greatest of all time. I, I loved it, though. I enjoyed every part of the season, you know, the goods and bads, for sure. It's always some older guys that's around the program or involved with the program. Any of them that you cool with, that you hit off with? Yeah, Grant Hill. Mm -hmm. G-Money. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Talked to him all the time. Saw him last night, actually. There was a, we had like a Duke type dinner. Saw the Duke alumni that's out here, all the players um, had a dinner. So that was cool. Tatum, mm -hmm. talked to him a lot. Of course. Zion, and then a bunch of other ones, Quinn Cook. Like, just, it's, it's a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I met a lot. I met a lot of alumni, and they all, they all, you know, give me their number, you know, let me know that, you know, I'm, they're open whenever. So it's a, it's a real brotherhood for sure.